Hello YouTube and welcome to UK Highland Photography. Today we're going to be having a look at the on shop mask within the GIMP editing software. So let's have a look first at my photograph. So here we have a lovely stag during the rotten season. Now as we zoom in we can see that the eyes and the nose etc look kind of soft looking and it doesn't a soft looking stag is really something we don't want to be seeing particularly during the rotten season so what we're going to do is we're going to enhance this photograph through the on shop mask tool so what we're going to do is we're going to go over to filters we're going to go to enhance and then we're going to click on on shop mask this then opens up this box now if we just make this wider we will see that we've now got our preview area what has happened here is GIMP is automatically applied the last settings it was that I did use with regards to the shop mask tool so if I click here, then we will see that this photograph now here is exactly the same as the photograph we see here. So if I press this, this then sharpens the image and this gives you a preview of what this photograph will look like with these settings here. So this is how you sharpen an image. If you move more to the right, you will see that the image becomes more sharper. And you will also notice that the further to the right I go, the more of a halo effect I get around the actual stag. So if we bring this back, you will notice that the image is still sharper, but we just don't have that much of a halo effect. So I'm going to bring that right back. So that is basically simply how you use the on shop mask tool so now that i am happy i'm just going to go ahead and press ok and the computer is going to apply the mask to my photograph and as you can see this is the before and this is with the mask so this is the normal photograph and this is the modified photograph with the masking tool. So there you go guys, there was a working example of how you use the on shop mask tool within the GIMP editing software. Remember to subscribe to the channel and when you get the time check out our online shop over at www.ukhighland.com